Hi hey everyone, this is LAR Games, and today I'm watching episode 12, the not last episode of Moggy Brilliant Park. So, kind of ended on a cliffhanger last time with uh, them still being short of people, so I guess we'll just see what happens there. Maybe they'll get like some sort of sudden bursts of uh, people. I don't know. Maybe it will get bought off, and there has to be a whole other thing about that. I guess we'll see. Mmm. That's a lot of them. So it was a mis miscalculation. Alright, what are you guys gonna do? Skipple. Oh, come on, you can't say no to them. That's the guy they sent, isn't it? Is that the place they always drink at? <laughs> Her grandma. Oh, she's probably... Yeah. I, I feel that she's going to have the best effect, to be honest, using the internet. She probably has a lot of followers. <laughs> okay, I'm, I love that character. <laughs> Anything he says will be saving the planet. Like, <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Oh. Hmm. Let's see what happens. Nice. Some people came. Oh, yep. 
<laughs> a lot of them are drunk. It's fine. Of course. Who are these people? <laughs> oh. Well, that's horrible. I misunderstood that, what he said, and I just hate him more now. <laughs> So I guess they're regular humans. Oh, I, th oh, I thought she'd have more. Oh, she likes dojins, huh? Uh. Uh. I didn't expect that at all. So the people he called are gonna come over? Be nice if his whole high school came over and kind of found out that he was managing the park there. <laughs> the guy that delivering pizza. That's that's good. Eight more, huh? So it's gotta be people he knows. <sighs> what about his sister? She never really does anything. Don't cry, Totodile! This is way tenser than it... Well, no, I guess it deserves to be tense, but... Way tenser than I thought this show was going to be. Oh. Oh, no. Not them. They're the ones that are going to save the... <laughs> the earth is saved. <laughs> Those kids have some issues. And the Earth, who's standing over... Okay, I will stop, okay? <laughs> uh, nice. Well, somewhat. It's a, it's a mixed bag. <laughs> well, at least they're the ones closest. This kind of feels like a finale. <laughs> Why is that so funny to me? <laughs> Uh.
He just needs a spike on his back and he's toe to dial. No, I'm not going to like that. <laughs> it's still a mess. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, they're not getting that land back. Yeah, that makes sense, and very beneficial. Yeah, very smart. What's he doing? Oh, they was clapping. Okay, that's good. <laughs> hmm. All right. Well, he couldn't just be a regular guy, could he? Oh. I think he's that wizard. They, you, they put the curse on her. Yeah. No, nah, don't do that. <sighs> That's actually... <sighs> yeah. Well, I didn't expect this show to do that. <sighs> Shh. <laughs> 
Oh man. Oh man, I really hope that something happened. Deus ex machina, please. Fingers. <sighs> Come on, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> oh, thank goodness. Oh, that's getting me again. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> Not really too much behind that ship. Still going to go with the princess. But also, you know, a uh, red-haired girl. You know, after all he did for that park, he, he should at least deserve to be able to get in free anytime he wants. Oh, so it was up to him? I thought it was like a deal or something. Since I don't work in here anymore. Well, that was ruined. I meant to say, since I don't work here anymore, I'm cosplaying. But it. Never mind.
I do wish we got to see more of his, like, arrogant attitude. Because it is fun. Alright, so this really did feel like a finale. So what the heck are we going to see in the next two episodes? Alright. Uh, cool. I have absolutely zero predictions for the next episode. Well, I'm lying there. I, I can guess, you know, maybe it's going to be like fan service episodes or maybe like just pretty much what an OVA would be for. Maybe like an episode where they go into the, the life of each individual important character. So I really don't want to see, you know, the day of any of the stuffed animal characters that except the Earth, that one. <laughs> Uh, you can make a whole anime about that one now, and I would probably enjoy it. <laughs> uh, Alright, but I guess we'll see. But, uh, man, I did not expect to get emotional in this episode. But uh, the princess crying there kind of... kind of got to me. You know, I, I have noticed that it, I'm... A lot more sensitive to moments where a character is going to die. And, you know, essentially, that's what was going to happen now. She's going to lose her memories of an entire year. So she was basically dying, I think. Like, if, if you don't have memories of something, if, like, your whole memory is wiped, that's equal to dying, in my opinion. Because if you lose everything, then you're not even the same person anymore. Of course, she wasn't really losing everything just a year, but still, that in that year, uh, everything that she's known for that whole year is gone, including everyone she met, everything she did, and all that. So, it's like the person that was created in that year is dead. And those kinds of moments do get to me almost every single time, no matter the character. There's, oh, well, uh, yeah, I was going to mention a couple series where that happened, but that, those might be spoilers, so I just won't mention it. Uh, but yeah, great episode. Probably one of my favorites. Uh, I'm so happy as well. All right, well, that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.